Hi, I'm Maddie Ziegler. Come. I said I want something big. I was a bad girl. I did some bad things. Jump, kick, turn, step. Hi, Sparkles. It's Jordan Sparks. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as always, we have another Dance Moms update from Dance Moms Reunion Teasers. Jump, kick, turn, step. You should see our kids! Two teasers from JoJo Siwa, the Ziegler sisters, Paige and Brooke. If you've been enjoying these daily Dance Moms updates leading up to the Dance Moms reunion on May 1st, please make sure to give this video a great big thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel if you haven't yet. I have about a thousand videos probably that are Dance Moms related or more already on my channel from drama to dance technique to just little insider things that we've talked about about the Dance Moms community. So make sure to check out those videos on my channel and let's hop right into it. All right, to start off the video, we have a little on set update from Maddie Ziegler herself. So. Hi, I'm Maddie Ziegler. Come get ready with me for the Armani Beauty Prisma Glass launch party. I'm in my natural yeah. phase of life. I do feel like the most confident with less now. Is it just me or is Maddie Ziegler just absolutely head turning stunning lately? Like she has always been super pretty, but like girl is flawless. All right, so let's hop into our update from Jojo Siwa. So Jojo has continued to be roasted on the internet regarding her new song released Karma, but also somebody else redid her song and they did a much better job than her. Plus, it looks as if Jojo Siwa is getting accused for texting and driving. Let's get into it. I was a bad girl. I did some bad things. I swear I did it all for fun and it meant nothing. Present to you. Karma by Jojo Siwa. I was a bad girl. I did some bad things. I swear I did it all for fun, but it meant nothing. It never happened. It was a secret. Like when a tree falls in a forest, no one hears it. Another late night, another crazy moon. All right, next we have an update from Brooke Highland again. She's been posting a lot lately. Celeb fam. Dad, who are you? I have a crush on my dad that might be a little weird. Oh, hey there. Just have her wrap my pre-games. I think we look a little bit alike, sis. We just kind of have like brown hair, but... I'm honestly unfazed by the judgment I get when I tell people I don't like steak. It wasn't an overnight decision. In fact, it wasn't even a decision at all. I just, my taste buds don't like it. I tried to like it, believe me. My mom tried. When she would make it for dinner, she's like, Brooke, eat your food. I've always been picky with meat. I do like chicken and I like, like burgers, but steak has always been the biggest no-no in my book. And I became a pescatarian for several years. Stopped being a pescatarian because it just wasn't healthy for me. When I went to college, I was eating at the dining hall and didn't trust their fish and stuff, so I just wasn't getting enough protein, so I had to start implementing like chicken and meats back into my diet. But steak has never been one of them. And I I try it, believe me. Like, I'm not just one of those haters that are like, ew, it looks gross. Like, no, I've given it a fair chance. And almost every time my boyfriend orders it, I try a bite. Oh, no, I would like to call myself a cheap date because I would pass up Ruth Chris for a McDonald's cheeseburger. Yeah, I've been craving an In-N-Out cheeseburger. I saw someone do a, a taste test video the other day and I was sitting there like, 
How much would it be to fly to LA right now so I can get some? I've been all over my For You page and praying they work on me the way I've been seeing on other people. It's actually insane. Stuff that comes out of your nose. I guess I should read directions. Jack, 8 to 15 minutes. It smells like really strong. Oh my god, it's like, it's like a putty. What the hell? I have a feeling this is really gonna hurt. Guys, I've never seen anything like this. Okay. You put the paper on. One paper. I'm going to make some food and then I'm gonna come back. Most random combo of food. Pretzels, Nutella toast. You can still see remnants of it on my plate. Pumpkin roll. We made this from scratch and I've had it in my freezer forever and I thought it the other day. So good. I'm like kind of scared. Oh. Look. Oh my god. Guys, it worked. Oh my god, you see all that? I can't stop looking at it. I'll link them so you can click right there. Alright, we're as good as new. We just have a few few less blackheads. I have a feeling this is really gonna hurt. Guys, I've never seen anything like this. Okay. You put the paper on. One paper. I'm going to make some food and then I'm gonna come back. Most random combo of food. Pretzels, Nutella toast. You can still see remnants of it on my plate. Pumpkin roll. So good. I'm kind of scared. Oh. Look. Oh my god. Guys, it worked. Oh my god. You see all that? I can't stop looking at it. I'll link them so you can click right there. Alright, we're as good as new. We just have a few, few less blackheads. And a little update from Paige Highland. <laughs> And next we have a little update. And a millennial pause from Abby Lee Miller. Hello everybody, Abby Lee Miller here from Dance Moms to remind you that I will be in San Francisco next month at the Are You Ready Dance Convention. Now this is the last stop on the Are You Ready 24 tour and I want to see you there in my classes. 2025 announcements are coming soon. New faculty members, exciting new opportunities for you, more staff members, and a new book by none other than CEO, founder, and mastermind, Miss Maggie. That's right. Now, I want to see you in San Francisco. I want to leave my heart with you in San Francisco. Parents, are you ready? Teachers, are you ready? Dancers, are you ready? to take my class in San Francisco. See you there. I said, I want something big. I want something that says I'm here. Beyonce. <laughs> you All right, you guys. Well, that is about it from me for today. I hope that you guys enjoyed this Dance Moms reunion slash Dance Moms cast update. If there's any other videos that you would like me to create, let me know down in the comments because I'm always looking for new content creation ideas here on this channel, whether they are Dance Moms related or not, just trying out new things. And make sure to leave your comments down in the comment section below. If you missed it, you can check out my last Dance Moms update over here. And as always, make sure to be weird, be wild, and stay sparkly. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.